Hello and welcome. My name is Paula Holmgren. I will be your student's art teacher this year. This is my eighth year here at iTech. Um, I started here in 2000, September of 2013. Uh, I started primarily as the middle school math teacher. I was math teacher for six years and in the last two years, or the last year and this year, I have become the art teacher as well. And I'm really enjoying it. It's a great time to allow my creativity and um, yeah, it's been super fun. Uh, I'm excited for this year. I cannot wait till we actually can come back into building, but um, I'm excited to get to know your student this year. The um, focus of study for this course is going to be on the elements of art and the principles of design. The elements of art include line, shape, space, value, form, texture, and color. And the principles of design are emphasis, balance, contrast, pattern, repetition, proportion, movement, rhythm, variety, and unity. We're going to focus this first semester only on the elements of art and projects that relate to those elements of art. And then mid to or about middle of second semester, we'll focus on the principles of design. Um, elements of art take a little bit longer than principles of design. for visual arts. Once you get into higher level of like uh, higher level art courses, they focus on the principles of design. Um, for remote learning, our project ideas that I have currently are drawing figures and, sh and items and then the art of handwriting. These are just some ideas I have currently, we'll hopefully add more in or unless we start on hybrid and then the hybrid projects ideas would be Painted shoes, cross stitch, and shark tank. Um, for the painted shoes, if you saw the original um, school supply list at the very beginning of the year, it probably mentioned a pair of white canvas shoes. That is something that your student will need once we start going back to hybrid because we will actually be painting shoes and it's super fun. And they've got some really cute ideas. Um, materials that they needed are first, those canvas shoes will need to be needed. In November, hopefully, is when we're going to come back as a hybrid. We'll hope. We'll see. Um, but as soon as we can get back to hybrid, those can white canvas shoes, um, the pencil, and the element of art booklet, which is a blue booklet that students will be collecting um, during the art supply pickup or the supply pickup. And then the art journals are going to be these brown covered uh, books that they'll have in this art supply pickup and then coloring utensils. Uh, so crayons, color pencils, and or markers, whatever you can find, have access to, those would, would need those. Um, these brown notebooks are brown books. They're old um, books that we are collected from various libraries that we're gonna be recycled. Um, we are gonna be using these as our art journals. So on Wednesdays, when we don't have a, st a structured class, what I'm gonna ask the art students to do is I will be giving them a topic and I want them to draw pictures based off that topic inside their art journal on the next available page. Um, the syllabus is linked to the can landing page of Canvas. It's also linked. Um, and what it covers is just the basics of what our art class has, what our office, my office hours are, and um, how things will be graded. Uh, there are some expectations for Zoom and um, Canvas, and uh, I actually will have to go back and edit this because that's not how we're going to focus, but um, that's just a brief overview of our Canvas. Um, my office hours are for Monday, Wednesday, and Fridays from 9.25 to 9.55, and then on Tuesday and Thursday from 3.20 to 3.50. Um, those are the best times for students to meet with me outside of class or um, if you need to call, call, call or email me, I will be responding pretty quickly in those office hour times. If you have any questions, please feel free to send me an email at paula.holmgren at banisty.org or yeah, and I look forward to talking to you guys as this year goes on. You have a lovely day. <laughs>